and welcome to this tutorial about RS GAN indicator. In this video, I will show you how to use this indicator in order to treat stocks and indexes. It can eventually work for Forex, but it needs a bit more training, in my opinion, as Forex is a bit uh, foolish uh, behavior. In this example, I am going to trade the last August month and we will see how to start with 100 euro or dollar. That is quite few and then see how much we can make at the end of the month at this broker the spx 500 is open during only the day so you won't have to trade at night of course if you live in the other side of the planet you will have to trade during the night well first of all let's have a look at the trading system here i selected fx blue trading simulator this is an ER that is typically designed to test manual strategy like we will have to do. It's very well done with many options and it's free. So here you can see that we can select the trading volume, the stop loss, the trailing stop, the take profit. There are other possibilities here when the trade is running we can close we can close everything that is open like stop orders or things like this, delete pending orders, close all winners, close all losers, reverse trade and things. Here we will use the basic features like buy, not sell, because the strategy doesn't include sell, only buy, and the close all trades when we will see that uh, our trade uh, basket is in the positive. This is a very good system to improve self-trading. We will simulate the real, uh, the real trading by using so the CR. And here we will use the historical data from the SPX and this data will be uh, shown in open bar or open price as you want it's the most practical way let me say to have a reliable flow of data the only small problem is that as we don't have all the ticks it's going quite fast because in between two bars there is nothing so when i will stop a trade in profit it will stop the trade only at the new the next coming bar and sometimes it's let me say eating a bit of the profit but it's a problem that you will not have in real trading because uh, we will have all the ticks present in real trading so when you will set stop it will stop well so let's now start the trading and the demonstration of how to do it okay so I just click on the button start. So here, what we want is to get the price coming here into these two lines or to cross these two lines. Of course, the position of these two lines will depend on the supports and resistance because it's the GAN low. It has to come down 50% here we are under, so let's take a buy a bit too late starting well and let's wait to get some profit here as i started too late it will maybe take some time best will surely be to take another one when we will see uh, uh, when we will see a new support like this Okay, we are reaching here a support, so let's take another buy. And we will stop. For example, can be at break-even of these two trades, or when we will have a nice profit if the price uh, is willing to come to come here up. But for now, let's wait. What we can see here is 
the magnet lines, they are quite fat here. It means that the price, uh, let me say, likes to be in this area. When the price will come here, where it is quite thin, it will normally go faster, either high or low. It depends. This is unpredictable. But here, the fact that it is thin means that the price doesn't stay here for long or didn't do this in the past. Well, this is, a, let me say, a hot first trade. Okay, the price is coming up here. Let's make some profit. A bit shy. A bit more would be good. Please. Well, we could eventually stop here, but the price will probably cross uh, this resistance. Oh no, it's a bit stuck in between, a support and a resistance. Yeah, could be, not too bad. We'll try to stop it at the right moment, so not now, for example. <laughs> oh, the price is tricky. Should have stopped it before because now I could at this place have took another trade and start to make profit again. Sometimes it's better to have a small profit but stop the trade, not be too greedy and be able to start new trades to get more after. Here we have already two trades, taking another one would be useless because we are not, uh, we are still up to the second one, so taking another one would not be a very good idea. So the only thing to do in this situation is to wait patiently. Okay, this one is really nice. It was a bit painful at the beginning, but it's okay. So, let's continue. Hope it will be better after. Okay, it's quite clear. A small trade, quite nice. Let's go again. Here we are rather high, so it's difficult to know or say what the price is willing to do. Would prefer the price to to come back to come back down before to take another trade. Oh, nice gap. Let's take it.
if price is crossing here, yes, it could give something very good. Okay, this is nice. Well, let's go on. Let's think by again. Ready to close. back again like this it's not that it's too late no okay Ooh. let's buy again we hit support and let's wait Ready? resistance but we could take another one yes Take a third one if it comes here, but maybe not. Shit. Thank you. A nice one. So let's continue. again too early too <laughs> well let's close it oh yes come on no we have to wait for the price to go down a little bit because it went up very fast again Let's 
go for a small trade. of small trades small profit but small plus small plus small finally will surely make big so let's go again missed it not to miss it so I'm gonna take the buy before to restart was not finished <laughs> not at all okay let's have a look now let's have a look at uh, what we did up to now we are uh, 70th and oh we made more than 100 percent this is very nice so what do we have? Oh, 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 I'm sleeping. Let's make a buy. Ready? Should maybe take it when it's down. Maybe not. I should have taken it. I missed it completely. Well, doesn't matter. Only two possibilities. We will go up here, we will make profit. It will go down here and we will take it again. So, just have to wait. For the moment, we have a very low drawdown. Uh, 
Uh, ooh, a nice fall. Let's wait for a support before to take it again. <coughs> a support. Okay. Let's buy it again. more pull can or not is there a support coming yes there is a oh no support here let's buy it oh, too late <laughs> and now let's wait patiently because we have quite a we have 50 percent drawdown hopefully we already earned 100 okay so now Let's wait and try to make a very nice profit of it. Yes, 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 come on. It should normally here come there because we have a thin part. As you can see, it's moving quite fast in the thin part. It's going back where he, he likes to be. If it crosses this resistance, it should normally go quite fast up here. But for the moment, it is stuck in between uh, these uh, two support and uh, resistance. take it so what do we have okay we just lost the last trade that was here we can see the line here that is in the, the wrong direction it's going south instead of north but we are reaching not too far for not too far from uh, 300 so let's go on and see what we can do until the end of the month. Well, so, yeah, one more time, I did not wait long enough. We could have made more profit, but it's the law of life, let me see. Here it's a bit difficult because of the scale. Everything is quite small and as it's quite up, we are a bit afraid to take again. But finally, maybe hiding this part would be more safe or uh, less mind killing. Let me see. Here, I will take it when it will come here. Up late or what? Yes, buy it and be ready. Let's go again. Okay, let's take it again. Oh, a bit too early. Yes, it was because of the scale. it's nice it's a bit we can see here that it's a bit stuck in the height it has some difficulties to go up and as we have no let me say history that is telling us uh, be careful there is a support or a resistance we are a bit uh, a bit into darkness but anyway as the risk is not very high we can we can be players 
let's go again. waiting to take buy I would like the price to come here but of course not here oh let's take a buy oh missed the pattern okay Maybe take another one here. Or not. Okay, buy another. It's not moving. Uh huh? Oh, yes. And here we go again. Uh, should have stopped it really late. It's coming inside again. So if it's coming here, I will take a second one. Electric. Ooh. Let's take a bite. One more time, we have quite a small drawdown, and we must be close from 300, or maybe we have more now. I don't know. Maybe take a third one. Too late. Yeah, too late. As I told you, here it's very fast because of the open bar system with with no tick in between. But in real uh, in real trading, of course, you can take advantage of all these tails you see here and uh, really make better trades that, uh, than I do, actually. Close. Well, 27. So we still have three days left. So let's go up.
Let's go again. Five. Too late again. If the price reaches this position, or well maybe this one, I will take another. What we see here with the magnet lines is that the price you, yes, the price could fall quite fast here if it's decided to, but for the moment it's going up where we have no information, so again we are in the darkness. Let's go again. We are up, we are the 30. Uh, 30, we have 31 day. Okay, one more day. Maybe. Smells the small train. Oh, okay. No more history. So, what do we have? We have a small loss at the end because we could not finish this trade, but net profit. We started with 100 and as profit we made more than 200 if we see the graph yes we are at 300 and something so this is quite a nice nice result this is what i'm calling commando trading once you have this best is to take your profit to take it away don't let it on the on the account take it for yourself or store it somewhere and start again with what you had in the beginning means with 100 because if you are a bit too greedy or the market is completely against you you can crash of course and so it's important to crash only your 100 uh, capital from the beginning and you can after that start again eventually with the the money you earned uh, pastly and usually if you select well uh, your instrument and take one that is really willing to go up for several months or several years uh, some indexes are doing this uh, uh, every time you can really make uh, nice profits with quite few risk and a really tiny capital uh, from the beginning. Okay, I hope this video was really helpful for you. And uh, never forget to be not too greedy when you are trading. Bye bye.